I'm Captain David Magnus with Captain Around Guide Service. We're out here on beautiful Grenada Lake today. Grenada Lake is known for its, its home of the big crappie, but guess what? It also has catfish, and that's what we're going to do today. I want to show you a leader that we're going to use. We're going to be dragging baits today. We, we're going to make our leader with our Gamma Polyflex line, 25-pound test. We're using <coughs> Boss Cat hooks, and I prefer to snail my hook. All right, we're going, we're going to snail the hook in which snail is a, they call it a knot, but it's really not a knot. It's not tied. A snail works simply by wrapping your line around itself, around the shank of the hook. And then we're going to run the end back through the back side of the hook, come out the front. And this, this tying actually works the tighter it pulls, the, the tighter that snail knot gets and it will not slip by coming out the front of the hook like that it creates a trigger so when that fish bites and you put a little pressure on him that hook triggers in to, to dig in to bite so we make our snail right there nice neat slick knot and then on the on the other end up here we're going to use a three-way swivel and it's actually a swivel made on a swivel so on the, on the big swivel on the top end is where we would tie our line to our reel. On the bottom end, we want to keep this in line with our swivel. So we're going to tie our leader onto the bottom end. We're using a uni knot to connect the leader to that swivel. Pull it down tight. Cut our tag end off. Now, we've got our leader made. We're also going to add a, a slotted cork. You don't have to use the slotted cork. Uh, I prefer them because I can take them on and off quick when they get damaged. I can just swap it out right there in a, in a few minutes. We're going to set that cork roughly six, seven inches above our hook. We're going to peg it off. And there we have our dragging leader.